Hi. I look a little disheveled. I was just getting ready for bed. Um, it's like 10.30 on Monday night. Um, I'm tired. I'm having a little snack of melon. Of cantaloupe and honeydew and watermelon. Dad and Lizzie had lemon meringue pie. Uh, melon sounded better to me. Even though apparently the lemon meringue pie is really good, a neighbor brought it over today. Homemade pie crust and everything. Um, apparently while I was at work today, um, Dad's boyfriend and his wife came over. They got Dad five shirts and a couple things of deodorant for his birthday. And some scratch-off lottery tickets. He won five dollars. And his cousins Roy and Wanda came over today. Maybe they brought the lottery tickets. And his cousin Bart stopped by, and he got cards in the mail from Latte Sue. They came today, both of them. Sue. He said, thank you very much. Um, he got a package today from Grams and Poppy. I filmed that on my camera. Um, and it took him 10 minutes and 20 seconds to open up that package. He's very slow. So when I process it, I'm actually going to speed up some of the parts because my dad's always like, come on, let's hurry. But when it comes to opening a package, it takes him forever. And he had a package from Loves to Craft for You, which oh, that was the cutest thing, Kim. And I hope you don't mind. My dad says your name in the video. If you mind, I will try to figure out how to just cut it out. But he, he says it several times because whenever he reads your card, he says, signed by, and then he says your name. So I hope you don't mind. Um, who else did he get something from? And then I got a package today from... It's over here. Da -da -da. Uh, scale Spinner, who's also in Michigan. My camera's in here. Um... This is all I've opened up on another video. It's in my camera. Because I filmed Dad opening up Ange and Ed's package. And then Lizzie filmed me opening up Loves to Craft for You, for which I handed to Dad. And so Lizzie filmed him opening that. And then Lizzie filmed me opening up this one from Scale Spinner. So all this video I have to render and stuff. So. You'll see them eventually. Dad is doing okay today. I don't know if Lizzie talked about this in her video or not because I haven't watched her video yet. But apparently Dad got up in the middle of the night and took the dog out. Hmm. We've all hounded him about that. What was he thinking? Although he is quite funny on his pain medicine. When he's sleeping he has these weird conversations with you and it's like he's talking some language that you can't understand. It's very funny. Um, tomorrow, the good-looking dude's coming to our house in the morning. Nick. Talked to him on the phone a few times today. Because we can't get the vascue therm thing to work right. The alarm keeps going off. And I've tried out disconnected and reconnected everything. There's no kinks in the hoses. I don't get it. And he's like, well, I can come over tonight if you want me to. I said, the morning would be good. So he's going to be here about 9 o'clock. I just want to look at him. So I'm glad it's him. I told him, I said, um, uh, people wished I would have filmed you more. He goes, what? I said, I put the video on YouTube of stuff at the hospital. and Yeah, I think they all think you're cute. Yeah, he is cute. But he's very, he's very nice. And I also talked to another guy from that company called Micah. Micah was going to come out here tonight, too. Um, so we're going to get that taken care of in the morning. And um, Grandma and I cooked Dad dinner for his birthday. Grandma brought over roast and gravy and mashed potatoes, and I made creamy cucumber salad and Brussels sprouts. And Grandma made him a cake. So we all had dinner together, and then I did the dishes and put all the stuff away. 
Lizzie's been the laundry fairy while I've been at work. Um, and Dad's maid. That's what Dad calls her. Lizzie's my maid. Grandma wishes she could stay for another week. Boy, it'd be nice if Lizzie could stay for another week. I said, um, she's got appointments. So, Grandma's going to come over on Thursday and sit with Dad while I'm at work. Friday, I don't know what we're doing yet. Because I work all day by myself at the office. So, you have to find some people to come up and entertain Dad. And make sure he doesn't do stuff that he's not supposed to. Okay. Hospitals want you to do a bowel movement before you leave, right? Because he is not... Dad has not taken a number two since Friday morning before surgery. I thought they always ask you about your bowels in the hospital. Have you had a bowel movement? So, um, I told him tomorrow when he gets up to call his one, his doctor, and say, you know I haven't pooped. And to call the physical therapy people and say, hey, when are you coming? Because they were supposed to call today and did not. So that's the things that Lizzie's got to make sure he does tomorrow while I'm at work. That's about all. Let's have a piece of, um, honeydew. I love melon. It's really good. Alright, now I'm going to go watch a couple videos and then get in bed. So, this is my babble for today. Bye.